Hello everyone, welcome to my channel, Let's Talk About It Media 21. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and please hit the notification bell, that way every time I upload a video, you will be the first one to see it. No, all comments are alleged, in our opinion, and for entertainment purposes only. Where we discuss celebrity news, celebrity gossip, what's going on on IG and Google. So let's talk about it. The first thing many people are talking about is <sighs> Country Wayne and... Lisa Ray hanging out. And then the next one is um, Vivica Fox is talking about fathers are needed in the home. So let's go to the first clip. Many people are asking, are they dating? Are they just doing a skit? Lisa is pretty much always well known as wearing white. So I'm wondering if this is just a skit. For her to expand what she does. The next thing we're going to talk about. A strong father figure is needed. Vivica Fox put Nick Cannon on blast. After the number 10 baby is announced. Many people are asking. Why is Nick having so many children. And making these single parent homes single. He can't be everywhere. He can't be at everyone's house in the morning before school after school he can't so many people are saying what's going on with him everyone knows allegedly he suffers um and i it was around the time he was with or about to get a divorce from my mariah or mariah kind of stepped in and helped nick cannon unfortunately we know he allegedly suffers from lupus and if that has an effect on what's going on with him Many people are saying, why all of a sudden? He had a pretty much squeaky clean career, trying to be good to people, doing while and out, you know, doing Nickelodeon stuff. Why all of a sudden is he having all these children? And mind you, when you check out a video I did in regards to Nick Cannon, the women have to schedule time with him. Yes, they have to schedule time with him. So it's not like, hey, can you come over? No, you have to schedule it. And I'm sure, I don't know how many days you have to schedule it, but if he's busy, you, you, the woman, has to change the schedule. Well wishes. Well wishes. We don't know what's going on. He is sharing his celebrity team all over the place. Vivica Fox is speaking on it. So we're going to see what's going to happen in regards to this Lisa Ray thing. So this is the other topic. Tom Brady and Janelle are fighting over parenting styles. Um, went to couple therapy. <laughs> They're trying to save their marriage. I had been hearing that there was concerns in regards to their marriage and what was going to transpire, what was going to happen. Some of her friends were asking her to uh, redo her prenup. But well wishes. They've been together for many, many, many years. And him deciding to go back into um, playing football might have been a factor. Maybe she thought that he was going to be there more helping with the kids. And he decided to, to go back into, mind you, he had said that he was going to stop playing. And a lot of people did a video on it. And then he was saying, oh, that's not true. And then like a month later, he did retire. So there was a lot going on. But well wishes to uh, Tom Brady and Janelle, uh, Giselle. Also, it's being alleged, I think he was in Kanye's comments as well and I think Kanye said something about I don't think Tom Brady likes Pete Davis either something like that and also Tom Brady was trying to give Chloe and Kim um, applause for all the good American and the skims but like I said before there's a lady that has co-ownership you know they're co-founders but there's different ceos and founders of skim and good america so maybe he needs to look that young lady up it's the young lady i did a video on she was on shark tank and i want to say she's the only african-american that's been doing extremely business great business on shark tank but well wishes if he wants to consult them that's fine here nor there the next topic we're going to talk about is being said that giselle Beauvais son oliver is accused of cheating on his wife with Vanderpump Rules star. And maybe, she, man, it might be going through a bit of divorce. 
there's been a lot of things going on with Giselle, I mean Garcelle Bouvet, in regards to one, the young lady's gone too far with putting her kids out. Oh, get out, get out. We had talked about that. And then in regards to um, Garcelle talking about her son's history with different things in regards to whether it was drinking or whether it was regards to whatever. But then a lot of people are saying, you didn't have to put it out there. But she probably put it out there because people were going to find out. And then it said that people are in her son's, younger son's DMs talking about a bunch of stuff they shouldn't be talking about to kids. So I guess Bravo made an announcement. Don't be, you know, rude to our castmates. You know, they're doing a reality show. They're here to entertain you. You know, younger children are off limits. But well wishes in regards to her son, in regards to her younger sons. Nobody should be yelling at her younger sons. And nobody should be sending crazy messages to her son. So well wishes to her. Um, Let's see. <sighs> You're special, huh? Ray J calls out uh, Kardashian mastermind Kris Jenner after Kanye West um, explosive rants. So everyone knows Kanye has been sending out very, a lot of messages. He's also been promoting his school. Um, he's also been showing that he is doing extremely well in regards to selling his glasses and a lot of his friends are helping in regards to that ad. But what's been going on is a lot of things. One, Adidas is trying to sell his items, uh, similar items and trying to infringe on his trademark. Two, Gap, he's having problems with Gap. Many people are saying it's all to help with the Hulu show. No, people stealing from you don't have nothing to do with the Hulu show. People are so silly. So well wishes in regards to that. So you now have Ray J speaking out, will he sue? You have Kanye speaking out, will he sue? And this is the biggest thing. Have you noticed? It's almost like a shut up and dance. Ooh, you ever thought about it that way? Rob, it doesn't do a lot where we see he's not as successful as his sisters. Rob should be up there with his sisters. Why is it that she's only empowering her daughters? Where is Rob? So it's almost the same situation that they're wanting Kanye to shut up. They're wanting Ray to shut up. They're wanting Travis Scott to shut up. They're wanting um, Tr Tristan to shut up. And the guys aren't. The guys aren't. So I think in the future, a lot of the girls are going to start getting in relationships because they're going to want somebody to kind of stand up for them. Right now, it's just them against these ex-baby daddies and ex-boyfriends. So well wishes. Kanye, and many people say, it is his responsibility to help raise his children. And if he wants to be a loving, caring father and he doesn't want his children to go through the same path that Kim has done, what is wrong with that? There's nothing wrong with that. A lot of things she did prior to dating him, period. Things she did, she did prior to dating him. She did the Ray J thing prior to dating him. She did the Playboy prior to dating him. So well wishes. Let me know in the comments how you feel about Ray J and Kanye speaking up against the K's and the J's. And will brands continue to fool with the K's and the J's? Is gonna is this gonna mess up their branding deal? Will Ray J sue because he allegedly took the fall for years? He took the fall. Everybody thought he put it out, and not a lot of people were educating us. You can't put that out. You have to have two signed signatures to put this out. But well wishes. Who knows what's going to transpire? Who knows what's going to happen? You know, um, Kim had put, Kanye had shared a message that uh, Kim had shared. And her mom was like, hey, I'm 67 years old. I don't need the stress. You know, I can't do the back and forth. Um, and Ray J was basically like, you know, my mom matters too. <laughs> my mom mat matters too. You were the mastermind. But well wishes, y'all. This is a mess. I don't know what's going to transpire, what's going to happen. Um, but I just wanted to do a media blast, many hot topics for today. Let me know in the comments how you feel about the K's and the J's, wanting the men to shut up and dance. Shut up and don't, you know, go against us. Right now, the only one that's in a healthy and safe relationship is Courtney. But even with that, 
the mom had said, oh, I'm happy that Chloe and Travis found love. And it's like, you should be seeing your daughter, Courtney. What? But here and there, many stuff, mo so much stuff is coming out. What will the fathers do? What will transpire? Well wishes to Kanye, Ray J. We'll see what transpires. We'll see what happens. They want to be liked. The K's and the J's want to be liked. They don't want to be seen in a bad light. I'm told Kim cringes when this is going on. She wants to be seen. She wants to be praised. She wants good media press. She wants good media attention. But well wishes. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Everyone, have a great day.